Hello everybody, my name is Cal, and today we are going to be starting our very own Pokemon Fire Red Let's Play. And uh, I'm doing so on an emulator. Um, I gotta figure out what the buttons are. Alright, so I'm doing so on an ep emulator. It's called the Open EMU Emulator. And uh, I found this emulator, and it actually saves the game, and so I'm very happy I found this. But without further ado, here we go on our Pokemon Fire Red Let's Play. Um, I'll talk about why I picked this one after all this junk. Hello there, glad to meet you. <coughs> oh man, welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. People affectionately refer to me as the Pokemon Professor. This world is inhabited far and wide by creatures called Pokemon. For some people, Pokemon are pets. Others use them for battling. As for myself, I study Pokemon as a profession. But first, tell me a little bit about yourself. Now, tell me, are you a boy or are you a girl? I am a boy. Uh, if you guys didn't know, I am actually a guy. So, let's begin with what is your name? My name is... Cal. Uh, I'm doing this all with mouse and uh, keyboard, so I c it's going to take me a few few tries to get used to the keys. This is my grandson. He's been your rival since you both were babies. Erm, what was his name now? Um, we're going to go ahead and name him my rival. We're going to name him Tom. We're going to name him Tom. Um, was it Tom? Yes, that's right. I remember now. This guy doesn't even know his own grandson's name. But uh, anyways, Cal, your very own Pokemon legend is about to unfold. The world of dreams and adventures with Pokemon awaits. Let's go. Um, this was, this is one of my favorite games of all time. Uh, just the Pokemon series in general. And I saw that, like, that Pixelmon, uh, Pixelmon, the Minecraft mod, has been getting a lot of attention lately. We're going to sit down and talk real quick. Uh, it's been getting a lot of attention lately, and uh, it made me really just miss Pokemon. So that's what I'm. Uh, that's what I'm doing is I'm playing Pokemon now, and I found an emulator that runs it on my computer, and I found that it saves. So well, we are in Pallet Town. Um, I've played this game about five, eight times. It's been a lot. Five to eight times. Um, I. Just the nostalgia this game is going to bring back. I'm going to know where almost everything is. So we're going to do a complete walkthrough of the game. But at the same time, um, I could also be quite newbie. But my goal is to beat the Pokemon Elite Four. Tom, let me think. Oh, that's right. I told you to come. Just wait. Here, cow. There are three Pokemon here. Haha. <laughs> What? Why did it say haha? -ha? The Pokemon are held inside these Pokeballs. When I was young, I was a serious Pokemon trainer. But now, in my old age, I have only these three left. You can have one. Go on, choose. Tom. Hey, Gramps, no fair. What about me? Be patient, Tom. You can have one, too. Um, of course... Oh, man, I've had so much deliberation. Charmander... Because Charizard is my favorite Pokemon of all time. But Blastoise is a freaking beast. But then there's no good grass type Pokemon in the game really. So maybe Ivasaur would be the best. And I've never really played through with a Bulbasaur. I don't know. Bulbasaur or... I've played through with a... Blastoise before, uh, Squirtle, Blastoise. I've played so many times with Charizard. We're playing Fire Red. I gotta go Charizard. Charmander to Charmeleon to Charizard. Alrighty. So, that is the Pokemon that I picked. Cow received Charmander from Professor Oak. Alrighty. Do you want to give a nickname to the Charmander? Nope, not right now. So, of course, he's gonna pick Squirtle. I'll take this one then, just keep Squirtle, so that way he can just purposely kick my ass the entire fucking series. And I'm going to walk down here, and he's going to want to have a battle. Cow, wait, I'll take you on. 
Alrighty. So here's our very first battle with Charmander. Let's see what see how it goes. Alright, I'm still getting used to the buttons. Sorry here. I sent out Squirtle. I sent out Charmander. Alright. Yeah, Oak, I know. I know how to battle Pokemon. I've played this game more times than I care. To admit. Alright, come on. Come on. Come on. For those of you who don't know, you have special attacks. Um, I never use any attacks besides um, damaging attacks. I don't see the point in using like Growl or Tail Whip like Squirtle just used. Uh, I just think they're stupid and I don't see the point. I'd rather just attack, attack, attack. So that's my play style. Um, that's how I'm going to play through it. And yeah, so get used to that. Because there's going to be a lot of attacking. So the battle should stay fairly interesting, I'd imagine. Uh, I'm going to have to do a little off-screen grinding at points in this series. Because it may get a little boring to watch me repetitively just battle Pokemon. But I'll bring you guys along for the adventure. Level 6. And then halfway to level seven. Boop boo boop boo boop boo boop to boo boop boo boop boo. Hopefully you guys can hear the sound. And turn it down just a smidge. Alright. Alright. Alright, yep. I I I know how this I know how this all works. I'll make my Pokemon battle to I'll make my Pokemon battle to toughen it up. Cow, Gramps, smell you later. Now what I've never understood is now this freaking Bulbasaur just sits here. Why can't I have him? Huh? Now Bulbasaur is just gonna sit there for eternity. No one gets him. Alright, so R damn it. Yeah. I couldn't remember if Oh shit. It's really weird because, like, this is the Game Boy Advanced version, technically. So, there's only A and B buttons, and then there's the D-pad. The D-pad's my normal D-pad <coughs> on my um, computer. But the A button is D, and the B button is S on my keyboard. So, it's a little weird. Look, look! I copied what it said on one of the signs. One of those trainer tips signs. Trainer tips. Press start to open the menu. Thanks. Alright. Pidgey! Um, I have always played that the best way to play this game is when you are low level like this is to just kick these Pokemon's butts because it's going to help you so much when you get to the first gym. Um, I'm nervous that you guys aren't going to be able to hear me so I'm actually going to... I know you should be able to but I'm just going to... Oh shit. I'm just going to turn it down just a smidge. The faster you level up, the better off you'll be in this game, so that's why I always level up real quick. Um, another problem I've always had with these games is you'll see it, and it's I tend to only train one Pokemon <laughs> at a time, and I neglect the other ones. So my Charmander, well, he'll turn into a Char Charizard. He'll get up to, like, level something stupid, and then my secondary Pokemon will still be, like, level 20. And, yeah, and then it costs me later on in the game, but I'm going to try to play this as tactically as I can. All right, if this level 2 Pidgey freaking... Oh, no. No. Oh, we're going to hold on. We're going to hold on to beat the level 2 Pidgey. Uh, the, the city I'm supposed to be going to is just up ahead, so... Okay. Do I get Ember at this level? Yeah. I do. Oh, no, I still have to go through another thing. Let's get lucky. Let's get lucky. Oh! Dude, 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 dude. Uh, we're going to run from this one, just so I don't faint. Got away safely. 
Uh, so, I've been doing a lot of thinking because school gets boring. <laughs> and so today I was thinking, I was just trying to put together my dream team uh, for my... Damn it, I keep hitting the fucking wrong buttons. Uh, I was just trying to put together the dream team for my Pokemon. And I want to... Uh, this is obviously going to be my good fire Pokemon. And then I'm going to want a good grass, a good um, water slash ice. And then, I don't know. Fighting, maybe? Gotta go up here. See, this guy's pissed off. I'm absolutely forbid you from growing through here. This is private property. So then you gotta come down here. And you gotta go into the mart. And then this guy's gonna say, hey, you came from Pallet Town. And he's gonna give me balls to take back to Professor Oak. You know, Professor Oak, his order came in. Can you take it to him? Cow received Oak's parcel. Cow put Oak's parcel in the key items pocket. Now I have to run this back to him. And then that guy will get up and I'll be able to move on. Doo -doo. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Doo -doo 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 the only thing I notice is that with this emulator, the uh, things are a little touchy. Like, alright, I let go of my mouse now, or I let go of my arrow now, and I, like, take a few extra steps. Just something stupid. I, nothing to complain about. Just lag, lag. Back in Pallet Town. See, like, I would have turned down that path, but well, the few extra steps made me go this way. Hit that button. Well, it seems to be growing attached to you. We've only had like two battles. <laughs> you must be a talented Pokemon trainer. What's that? You have something for me? Yes, I do. Cow delivered Oak's parcel. Ah, it's the custom Pokeball. I had it on order. Thank you. Tom, Gramps. God damn it, Tom. Stay out of my series, dude. I almost forgot. What did you call me for? Oh, right. I have a request for you two. Oh, we're getting the Pokedexes. On the desk there is my invention, the Pokedex. It automatically records data on Pokemon you've seen or caught. It's a high-tech encyclopedia. Cow and Tom, take these with you. Cow received the Pokedex from Oak. You can't get detailed Pokemon. You can't get detailed data on Pokemon by just seeing them. Oh, shit. You must catch them to obtain complete data. So here are some tools for catching wild Pokemon. Oh, Cal received five Pokeballs. Nice. Cal put the Pokeballs in the Pokeballs pocket. When a wild Pokemon appears, I'm about to burp. <coughs> it's fair game. Just throw a Pokeball at it and try to catch it. This won't always work, however... A healthy Pokemon can escape. You have to be lucky. Rather be lucky than good. Uh, to make a complete guide on all the Pokemon in the world. That was my dream. But I'm too old. I can't get the job done. So I want you two to fulfill my dream for me. Get moving, you two. This is a great undertaking in Pokemon history. Tom. Alright, Gramps. Leave it all to me. Cow. I hate to say it, but you won't be necessary for this. What a dick. I know, I'll borrow a town map from my sis. I'll tell her not to lend you one, cow. Ha ha ha. Don't bother coming around to my place after this. So that pretty much tells me to go to his place after this. Alright, so... I'm actually going to end episode 1 here, guys. And, um... In the next episode, we're going to get the town map. And we're actually going to start our adventure and our Pokemon journey. So, stay tuned. I know the first episode was a little boring. Got a few battles in. But, uh... Stay tuned, and I hope you guys will enjoy the series. So, uh, thank you guys for watching so much. Uh, leave a like if you want to see me continue this series. Uh, I hope you guys do. I hope at least somebody's enjoying it, because I know I'm going to enjoy uh, the nostalgia and playing through this. So, thank you all for watching. My name is Cal. I'm out for now. Peace.